Ah, zombie, zombie. Okay, okay, I'm running away. I'm running away. No! Hey guys, welcome back to my sanctuary. So, I do have this hole, this hallway that just ends abruptly and has this big drop after it, and that kind of did just get me killed. So, I need something to build here. I, I can't just have this empty hallway hanging there. So, I need, I, need, I need to think of something to build, but I don't really know what. Let me check my mail. Let's see if I got anything. Oh, I got something else. Wow. Oh, so, Exasquire sent me a letter, and he sent me this... Vision enhancement helmet. What does he say? He says, he 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 he. Uh, how how much of? Okay, H how much of this is there? This is this is a lot of he he's. Uh, th yeah, this is gonna take a while. I, I know it's only a hundred pages. It's just this is just all he he's. Let me look through all of this to see if there's any end to this. Oh, from your good. Old pal, ex Esquire. Okay, this was very interesting reading, very interesting literature. But I really want to see what this vision enhancement helmet does. Although I, this is probably fake because this is re just a regular chainmail helmet, it seems. But uh, I want to, I want to see what this does. Okay, I've, I've always not been able to see very well from up here. So let's see if this helmet can help with that. Uh, so, okay, what's going to happen if I put this on? Yo, this actually does enhance my vision. I can actually see the ocean clearly. Let me take a look. The sun looks a lot better. The, the rainbow looks a lot better. It's kind of like when I had a texture pack, but this I, I can see everything much more clearly. Whoa, look at the water. That looks nice. Oh, wait, that just gave me an idea. Seeing all this really cool reflective water gave me an idea for what I want to build. I should build a swimming pool here. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Now, this helmet makes everything look awesome, but I'm going to need to take it off for now because it is making things laggy. Okay, so I collected a lot of diorite, and I was going to use it for something else, but I, I guess I could use it for the swimming pool because that is good swimming pool material. So I will. I have a bucket. I'm probably going to need two buckets, but right now let's make some polished diorite because that's going to be good for, uh, for a swimming pool. That's going to make it look good, and I know this is lagging, but just give it a second. Uh, the, the, I don't know, for some reason the server is kind of laggy today. But yeah, this, this should be enough polished diorite. So let me go to the to the place where, okay, yeah, here's here's the spot where the where it kind of just ends. So I'm going to make some uh, sort of a birch, a birch pathway, and um, I'm going to extend it out here. Man, the lag is, what's wrong with the server today? Um, I'm going to extend it out here, and guys, I have to build here. You're going to have to... What was that look? What was that look? You're going to have to get out of, out of the way. I'm going to have to... See, can I parkour up here and sort of break this? Okay, so may maybe what I'm thinking is, since there already is a pathway here, I can have, like, kind of two entrances to the pool. So, let's see, where should the where should the pool wall be? I'm thinking the, yeah, the pool wall could... Or the edge of the pool could be right here. And, um, like, I have, I have jump boost because there's, uh, there's a beacon nearby, you see that? That's from a beacon. And it's, it's really helpful sometimes, but it makes things kind of annoying other times. Okay, so, yeah, this is where the, this is where the pool, pool wall, I'm not sure if you call it a pool wall. It's just the edge of the pool. This is, like, half underground and half above ground because it's kind of on a, on a hill. But um, that that's the goal. Now I was thinking I I probably need glowstone for the pool as well. I don't have any right now, but I do have another portal, and I have a good pickaxe, so I can just quickly go into the Nether and get like I don't know four, maybe a bit more blocks of glowstone. So first I'm making the edge of the pool, and then I'll kind of uh, dig dig this out. And of course I'm going to speed it up while I'm digging it because you don't you guys do not need to watch me do that. Okay, is this is this good? I'm thinking maybe a little bit, a little bit more in this direction. Okay, once these blocks actually disappear, then I can, yeah, ah, stupid lag. And I'm I'm gonna have to break these flowers, but I am going to I'm going to replace them. I'm gonna put them somewhere else because these flowers do look really nice. So I'll just have them around here. I'll just decorate the um, area around the pool. So. 
the hill around the pool will still be decorated. So excuse this ridiculous lag, guys, but I can still kind of do what I need to. So, yeah, there's just one more flower. I didn't have to get rid of that many flowers. Okay, that's good. So now I just build this, and we, we already have a nice a nice frame to the pool. Of course, that's not all of it. I'm still going to have to... Um, still going to have to... Uh, have more walls once I dig this out a bit more, but I'm going to speed that up while I do that. Okay, so right now I'm just going to speed this up while I finish up the frame of the pool. I have finished the frame of the pool, except now I can't get out. That's okay. I know what I'm going to do. I have to cover this whole thing in dirt anyway, because I'm going to put the water on top of the dirt so it can spread all across the pool, and then I'm going to break the dirt so the water can flow into the bottom of the pool. So you see, I've made a shallow end here, and I've made a deep end here, and there's kind of one thing in the middle. So the pool is uh, 7 by 5 uh, the inside of the pool. And now, first I'm going to go get some water and then I'm going to finish the paths. So, uh, let's see, can I make the jump? Uh, yes! Okay, yeah, that, that was easy. Uh, so I have two buckets here. Let's get some water. One, uh, two. And then we will walk back up, and I think I have enough birch planks to finish the path. And I will have to clear some of the area, but um, the flowers I clear will be used to decorate sort of the uh, yard around the pool. Not the yard, the, uh, the grassy area. What, what do you call that? This area. So I have one tulip here that I dug up. I'm just gonna have to place that there. I really like this biome. There's so many flowers and stuff. So I'm going to need to craft a bunch of stairs and yeah then I will make the path. So let's see how many stairs do I need? I'll, I'll start with... let's see, I'll, I'll start with 16... 16 stairs? No, I need more than that. Okay, uh, 28 stairs should be good for now. Uh, so, I think it's just a, a pretty straight staircase. I will have to do some digging, and this might be a bit, um, a bit laggy, but that's okay. The thing is, usually, uh, there's lag. Uh, the only time there's really this much lag on the server is when there's, like, a fight going on, because people are using TNT, and they're, uh, taking damage, and there's, uh, a lot of stuff going on, so there's probably a fight going on somewhere else in the server, but... Uh, I don't, let's not, let's not think about that right now. I don't want to think what that could mean. But, okay, right now, uh, all, all it means for me is that it's hard to place blocks because it keeps lagging. But it's, it's not, it's not that bad. It's just a bit annoying for now. Usually, usually the server's fine, though. Okay, so now we have the path that continues from here and goes down to the pool. It's time to fill the pool. So... Just start by doing this and wait for it to spread. Ah, the, the, the jump boost is making me go faster than I want. And then put this here, put this here. This is pretty easy to fill. Uh, oh no, I accidentally put it back. This, this is the problem with the with the lag. Okay, can I can I put it here? Yeah, okay. This is easy. And then I just have to break the I gotta break the dirt. Okay, while I'm waiting for that, I guess I'll continue making the path. So I'm going to have to dig out this part, and uh, the path is going to have to... I think it's going to sort of sneak around the pool, so it'll connect this this part by my house to that, like, hallway that has no end right now. So, yeah, it's, it's going to kind of sneak around here. Uh, so I, I guess I'll just have... Uh, should I? No, no, I'm going to have it extend out this way. So it's, it, the path is going to shorten from three blocks to two blocks. And then I'll just have stairs going down here, going down along the side of the pool, like this. And I will have to break some of the tree. I don't like breaking nature in Minecraft, because, you know, I, I really like the way things generate. But, okay, it'll, it'll, it'll kind of be, it'll kind of be going through the tree. Uh... Ah, this stuff keeps reappearing because of the lag. That's okay. So, once I'm done with this, 
I, okay, I'm probably going to need some more stairs. I think this is, actually, no, I don't, I don't want this here. This is good enough for now. I'm going to have the rest of the, uh, the decline when it wraps around more. Okay, so if, let's see, can the jump boost get me up here? No, it cannot. The jump boost is only annoying. It's not actually helpful. Uh, I should add, like, a different effect in that beacon, because because jump boost is not that helpful. It just makes it harder to walk, and the jump boost on top of the lag is making everything really annoying to work with. Uh, okay, is this going to disappear? Okay, there's a chicken down here. I'm going to have to cover the chicken in planks, at least to get some shade, because it's probably a hot day today. Um, and that sheep is still on the way. I, I'm, I, I don't want to. I don't want to have to push the sheep off the hill. But you know, I, I do kind of have to build. Okay. So is this mostly spread out? Yeah, mostly. I just gotta. I think I only need one more bucket in this whole thing. I just gotta put the the one more bucket right here. And yep, that should fill out the whole thing. So now I'm just gonna have to break all of this dirt. Okay guys, I have finally finished the pool even though there was a lot of lag. So now I have a path that uh, goes all the way around it and it goes down here. So now this is no longer just a hole that ends and there's a chicken exploring my house as well. Hi. Do I have seeds? No, I don't have seeds. Sorry. Did that chicken just go through the wall? Okay, there's also another animal that's being kind of noisy. And what you can do is what you can do is you can uh, kind of go around up here. Uh, I can go past the really noisy nether portal up up here, and then you can uh, you can go outside. Oh, there's a pig man. That's that's what the noise was making. Hi. Uh, I have not updated to 1.16, so there are still pig men here. Yeah, and then you it comes right around here. So there's a, a nice loop. So after all this work, after all this dealing with lag, I deserve a treat. So I'm going to put on this helmet. And go swimming! Whoa, okay, this pool looks so awesome with uh, with this helmet on. It looks like an actual swimming pool. It's a beautiful blue, and there's the ocean in the background, and there's the rainbow, and the, the sun reflects really well off of my house. Okay, I am so excited to go swimming. Do you want to go swimming with me, Mr. Chicken? I don't know what your actual name is, sorry. Okay, I am ready to go swimming now. I am hot and sweaty. So I cannot wait to wash myself off in this beautiful pool that I have just built.